So our story really started Parents Weekend of senior year. There is a reception every year at Parents Weekend for seniors and their parents and it's hosted at Matic. We spotted each other and knowing that we were both from Brooklyn, we said, oh, isn't this cool? Let's introduce all the Brooklyn parents to each other. So we introduced our parents. Apparently our mothers started talking and... They decided that we should ride home together for Thanksgiving. That was kind of the beginning of things, and pretty soon after that, you invited me to the senior semi-formal, which was the next week. So it's graduation day, commencement day, and very, very late, like the wee hours of the morning, we decided to go have one last walk around campus. And we ended up at Manning Chapel, and we sat on the steps of Manning and had a very intense conversation where we basically realized we thought this was something really special and we wanted to try and keep it going. So he proposed at Campus Dance 1995 and he proposed pretty much at that exact spot in front of Manning where we had had that conversation um, back in 1991. Of course we ran into the bear and so we had to take a picture with the bear. At our wedding, we really wanted to do something to commemorate the fact that we met at Brown and that it was such an important part of our relationship. I designed a cake topper for our wedding cake that was two little bears and I made little brown pennants for them. And when they rolled the cake out, the band at our wedding actually played Ever True. So we've always tried to stay really connected to Brown. We have really carried the Brown brand with us throughout our lives. We really have always done our best to give back to Brown and uh, we're very grateful for the opportunities that Brown gave us and we're hoping that we can pay that forward for the next generation. Ever True. Ever True.